When we design a double wound transformer, we can have any combination of star and delta windings that we require. Here's a star star transformer, with a star winding on the primary and a star winding on the secondary. A star star transformer traditionally has a zero degrees phase shift. Let's see what that means. A zero degrees phase shift means that the voltages on the primary and secondary windings are both in phase and there's been no phase shift from the primary to the secondary winding. A simple way to show the phase shift across the transformer is a clock face with zero degrees at the top. We then show the phase shift in 30 degree increments. 11 o'clock will be plus 30 degrees. As we can see the voltage on the secondary is now 30 degrees in advance of the voltage on the primary. Going the other way now, 1 o'clock will be minus 30 degrees, which means that the voltage on the secondary winding is 30 degrees behind the voltage on the primary winding. If we want to represent the transformer as a symbol, we call it a Y, Y0, where the capital Y represents a star primary winding, the lowercase y represents a star secondary winding, and the zero represents a zero degrees phase shift. Let's now look at a delta delta transformer. Again, a delta delta transformer normally has a zero degrees phase shift, and the clock faces are therefore the same as the previous transformer. We represent the delta delta transformer as a d d zero. Let's now look at a delta star transformer. Because of the physical arrangement of a delta star transformer and the way the vectors are arranged, we naturally get a plus 30 degrees phase shift as we go from the primary to the secondary winding, as shown on this diagram. If we show the delta winding, then superimpose the star winding over the top and measure the phase angle, we'll see the difference is 30 degrees. Therefore, on the clock faces, the secondary winding is shown at 11 o'clock. This is represented in the symbol, which is a DY11. Let's now look at a star delta transformer. Again, because of the physical arrangement, a star delta transformer also has a 30 degrees phase shift, but in the other direction. The clock faces represent this, with the secondary winding now showing 1 o'clock. Is classed as a YD1 transformer. Designers take this phase shift into account when they design the electrical network to ensure that the voltages that appear at each voltage level in their network always have the same phase angle, as trying to join two networks with a 30 degrees phase shift would be blocked by the synchronizing relay on the circuit breaker.